worst couples ever. What's going on guys, Shot Clips here once again, and I switch out some wild clips of the worst couples I can find, but in this first one guys, it is definitely not good either. Basically, I guess we have this woman who's trying to get onto this bike. I'm not sure why she thought this was going to be possible, but I found it very amusing, and also pay attention to the guy at the end, he cared more about the bike than her. Hurry up, I'm ready to go. Don't rush me, I couldn't find my lighter. What's your ass, your little lighter? What you say? I said we for the ride all nighter. Hey, so do not let me fall. Get my leg up. Oh. Damn, what already said rock the boat, but not rock the bike. Just turn my shit into a Mario Kart. Pull off, hey, Seuss. I am trying. You just holding my shoulders down. Stop trying to pop a wheelie. Oh, come on. God damn, Bertha. How the hell my Papa Willie parked? Thank you, sir. Help us. What the hell you do to my bike? Hey, man, it was her. She did it. Uh, real, real like my man, man. <laughs> Yeah, look, she, she know it. You say mermaid? For you. Nah, for us. <laughs> no, no way. He called. And this next one just goes to show you that you shouldn't bring children everywhere. They don't make every single moment cute, you know? Hey, mommy. Oh, 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 no. Quick run down. We'll stand here. You can't jump, it's too shallow. Papi. When your boyfriend says he's going to teach you a dance. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. <laughs> and this next one, I did want to show this clip for everybody who's cheating. Basically, we have this guy who pretty much told this girl he's not cheating by saying one phrase over and over again until she believed him. I'm not sure if this woman's just stupid and scared and doesn't want to leave him, or she actually does believe him. But yeah, if this worked out, I think it could work out for you guys too. Check out this clip. I convinced my girl that I didn't cheat when I clearly got caught cheating by just repeating I was home. <laughs> yeah, I was on the phone for that. <laughs> On the phone, yo, that nigga repeated, <laughs> but I'm in the house, <laughs> bruh, bruh. My shorty, I'm home, I'm home right now. Yeah, my shorty calls me and go, Who the fuck is such and such? And why is she telling me you live there and you be with her on weekends? And I go, What the fuck you talking about? I'm in the house. She go, She said, Y'all be going on dates. I go, How can I go on dates? I'm in the house. <laughs> She's like, she's like, nah, she's telling me you told her this, you told her that, and then said the third, she said you was with her. I go, how can I be with her if I'm in the house? And repeated that to everything she said. No lie. She said, yeah, I know you right. I knew she was lying. No lie. No lie, bro. And this next one, this woman just got absolutely rejected, but I do give her props for shooting her shot. She probably had no idea this guy had a whole girlfriend. That's so why I think it's a pretty stupid tactic in order to get a girl, but I guess it works sometimes. There's for rookies. Go to Facebook Marketplace and search for wedding dresses. It'll show you recently divorced females in your area. From there, you can filter by size. The world is awful. Not with me. Uh, no. No? Okay. Maybe okay. because I have a boyfriend. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, he's enough to know. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, funny. All right. All right, later. Are we watching Riz in 4K? This is getting kind of fun. And this next one, this guy's an absolute king. Basically, she's an adult movie star. And she's asking him, is that an issue for her if she was ever to date him? He's like, absolutely. He would never date her. And he gave his reasons. And every single point he gave made absolute sense. And the girl was speechless. That girl's not going to take from anybody else but me. Even if she's paid? Yeah, money doesn't run my life. Money's not good enough to give up my morals that you haven't in your face and getting busted on and you gonna come home and kiss me and build a life with me nah well i'm a star and i haven't sold my soul so and uh I, that's not really information for my life i told you my opinion i don't care if you're a or ain't a bad enough so would you fuck me like i said earlier i would smash but i would not date <laughs> I'm a great, I'm a great girlfriend though. You know, you're kind of passing it up. Do you? A little I'm side not, question. You're, gonna be, you're not gonna be a great girlfriend while you're taking from those five guys. So you know, well, I don't do bangs. Number one, number two. So would you think that I wouldn't be able to come home and treat you right, cook you dinner? Those aren't qualities you want. You would want in a girlfriend. Well, I think I can find those qualities and for them to do something that I respect outside the home. Unfortunately, it's not about what you do in front of me; it's what you do behind me. That's what I'm 
And this text with this girl decided to hug this man who came behind her back, and I guess she thought it was some guy, but it turned out to be her long distance boyfriend, and it took her a really long time to realize who was hugging her. This just goes to show that she's probably cheating on him. Hold up. Now pull one of these right here. Stop. Move, boy. What you doing? Yes, but if you listen to how she said stop. I understand, but if you listen to how she said stop. So why should I stop when you say stop, but you did? Because she didn't say stop how no, I'm saying stop. No, stop me. Stop, right? I'm saying okay, stop. Okay, then. No, no. Don't, don't do tell this me stop. shit. No, Please. no. Don't tell me stop. And this next of these two people are definitely cheating on one another, especially the guy, in my opinion. Basically, this guy asked them how long they've been together. First off, he had no idea how long they've been talking for. Not only that, they don't care about one another by the looks of it, especially for, what, a six to seven month relationship. You should have some kind of feelings, but this guy doesn't seem like he cares at all. Hell nah. Hell nah. I don't trust nobody. Y'all together, though? Yeah, I just got with her probably like a couple months ago. months ago. It ain't been seven months, five months. It's been like six. Five. Five. Five, five months. We're gonna say you're five. First two don't count. It, it just started. First two do not count. Oh, only what? The first two what? That was first two months. That ain't count. Oh, okay, yeah, five months. Yeah, what, what question you got? <laughs> I'm just making sure y'all done, you know what I'm saying, y'all see it. Go get a diamond tester, it's gonna be. Go get one. Go get one. Go get one. All you gotta do is go get one. We gotta do a loyalty test on you too. That's fine, that's fine. You can do that, you can do that. This is the question I got for y'all. Is liking somebody else's pictures cheating? Nah, hell nah. Mm -mm. Nah. You can do nah. what you want. That don't mean you talking to that person. Nah, I could look. You could you could be just liking somebody's shit just and to, you can be your just friend. to support. Yeah, like you could just be supporting somebody. Like if I see a female, she got that shit on. She got that shit on. I'm gonna probably like her shit. Right. But I ain't gonna be commenting hearts and all that shit. Right. I like her shit. That don't mean nothing, dude. And this I sort of find it super funny. Basically, there's a guy, I guess he was on a date with a girl. So something odd happened with her teeth. This is probably one of the funniest clips I've ever seen due to the fact that he kept her teeth. Check out the clip, you'll see exactly what I mean. I can't lie, after this one, yeah, I am finished. I am done. I'm done with females. How can I go on a date, yeah? And everything was going well, yeah. I'm just going to get straight to the point. So we come back to the car now, this exact car, and we start lipsing and doing whatever on it to get. And then she started to give me brain. Bro, please tell me, why did her teeth come out when she was giving brain to me and i'm there not deep in it not deep in it and then after she looks up at me and she smiles and all her bottom teeth are gone and she's like oh shit she's like oh shit where is it where is it bro you think i gave that back to her i had to keep this shit she ain't getting her teeth back after that one look look what the f i hate nutella i don't like nutella he i died. think it's shit <laughs> <laughs> no, no. And this next one, this guy absolutely flamed this woman. Basically, she wrote a book about women casually dating around and sleeping around and how it should be absolutely normal. But then again, she's still single and not finding a husband, and she's kind of curious why until this guy had to break it down for her and explain she's just a side chick. What makes me a what? side chick? Because the what? I'm beautiful? And no, what? because the one who everybody f but does a wife. That's a side chick. Sorry. So who have I, who, who have I been side chick? You wrote a f book. Who have I been a side chick? But I was never a side chick. Well, when you write well, a book about having casuals. About, and I've by the way, not before. one of them claimed you. We assume, you, you know why men don't claim women? Because we have our real girl that we don't want to tell about you. You know. She's a 10, but she got 100 bodies. Oof. 100 bodies. If you've been dogged by 100 men. Nah, no. You, you, you got you come in with more emotional baggage than I'm willing to deal with. Now, for the worst clip on the list, guys, we have this guy who's proposing to his girl, or I'm not sure who she, who she is, in the club. First off, she's not even dressed appropriately at all. I'm not sure why he's with her. Your girl shouldn't ever dress like this in public with you, without you. It doesn't matter. This guy clearly has no morals or no standards at all. But the fact that he did it in a club as well just goes to show that people just don't give a damn. Check out this insane clip. <laughs>
Well, that does it for you guys so much for watching. See you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace.